Hello, this is the third episode of the Core Ritual series. If you haven't watched the other two, the playlist link is in the description. So first we're gonna refactor our code. Um, then we can style the editor. After that, the syntax might look a little bit different, but we'll get into it in the next episode. Let's move the get editor function and make its own class. We inherit from the Cintilla class so we can use this function directly. You can press Ctrl D to do this. Now we can make an instance of our own class and return it. We also need to create a font. And that should be it for the refactory. Now we can move on to styling our editor.
we are going to change this icon but to do that we need to create a resource for the first This is how a resource file looks like. You can put more files using this. But for now, this is all we need. We're gonna use this to convert this to a pi file. Then we can import these resources to our scripts and QSS files. I'm gonna make a simple script to do that. We aspire CC5 to convert our resources. You can execute this command in your command line. I am just making a simple script. This is what a resource file looks like. You don't have to worry about how it works. We just convert our files into bytes and we can use it. Make sure the names are exactly the same.
this should be it for our styles let's check it out looks like our close button is not showing this let's see what's wrong okay looks like i forgot to use url Looks like we have an issue with this folder icon. Let's fix it and also refer to it. We're gonna make a function for this as we'll be adding more icons to the sidebar, not only the folder icon. We'll be adding more and tables to the sidebars so code will be different but for now let's just add a quick fix this will also be an event and a type We can just pass the name so it can react to different level differently. This should be it. This should be tree frame. We are hiding the file manager. So this is it for this episode, we will be updating our syntax highlight in the next episode, thanks for watching.